Hey guys, welcome to my page. Uh, so tonight I was just doing a little experiment. I thought I'd share it with everybody on YouTube. Um, this is my little four pole motor. Um, four one inch magnets, Neos, just like on some of the other videos. Um, there's four windings on these coils. Um, these go in series and then they go parallel. Um, and then they go into these. These are each a uh, half bridge circuit. So this is full bridge um, circuit with both of them together. And then the output goes into a full bridge rectifier and then to the cap discharge and to the second battery. Uh, what's pretty neat is this is running right now real slow, but uh, we're talking 20 milliamps. So um, that's so, so minuscule for something like this. Um, it runs real smooth. Um, you could turn it up a little bit. And you can see the the waveform kind of <laughs> but yeah it's flip flopping and um, these are on optical timing so there's two optical timing in the front there but um, yeah this is 200 milliamps and um, it's making my cap discharge work so pretty neat little circuit um, the only bummer is this is a, a P channel and N channel and P channel and N channel and then the polarity is reversed on each one um, for different um, as it's flipping back and forth on polarity um, but the resistance of the P channel is really high so it kind of limits the circuit to a couple amps but but it does work neat for little experiments like this so let's turn it up a little bit and get up to, to about one amp So there's one amp, and you can see on the scope, it's just flip flop, flip flop. So pretty cool. Um, you see the speed is of this compared to some of the other videos. So 895, so 900 RPMs at one amp. Um, the output's pretty nice. It's just kind of kicking back and forth at five amps. But um, at full power, about 220, about 200 milliamps, and um, 1,250 RPMs. But I don't know if you could see that on the screen. But when you do a full power, you, the spikes are kind of at a minimum. But as soon as we turn down the pulse width modulator, just a little bit, you start getting all the spikes again. The output output starts working. So full power, this thing's not really putting out very much but as soon as you engage the pulse width modulator at about three quarters of an amp starts getting into a uh, nice output and here's the scope shot well, anyway hope you guys like the experiment thanks for watching